ordered for evacuation. Our DC teams can't keep up with the beating we're taking. Step it up, Rhodes. Helicarrier hull integrity compromised. Colonel, we've got fire throughout the ship. Intercept the next wave. Helicarrier hull integrity critical. You're late. And it's dead. No, it's... Guys! Guys! Stop! Jeez. So what, it's napping? Kinda. The protean inside it was rebuilding it as you stood there, smiling all smug-like behind your faceplate. Wait, what? Wait, what is not the question you really want to ask, is it? What you really want to know is, how do we kill it once and for all, right? We don't. We don't kill it. Let it rebuild itself. It'll take a while, and I've got an idea. Jarvis. I assume we're preparing the Ark Armager for a frontal lobotomy, sir? Yes, we're going to trepan the holy hell out of it. And then I want to put racing stripes on it. So think like me, only pretend that you are in fact a global AI network developed by a genius, executed by a lunatic, and built to weaponize everything you can. Where do you start? Earthquakes. Close, but not quite. But tell me why you went to earthquakes. It's global, it's everywhere, and everything important sits on it. That's why S.H.I.E.L.D. does business from up here. Good start, but Stark Industries doesn't do any seismic work to speak of. And as you just said, some important things are immune to earthquakes. So, if you won't be weaponizing the ground, you'd weaponize... The sky. Green Grid. Another gold star for our CEO, ladies and gentlemen. Project Green Grid is Stark Industries' first steps in developing the atmosphere's capacity for storing and transmitting power. Well, let's say they did it. What would it look like? A storm? Not just a storm, Rody, but... An a... evil storm? Very funny. Also true. Power transmission through ionization creates storm activity as a side effect. Highly charged storm activity. You actually created plans to do this? To weaponize the damn sky? Technically, I created plans to transmit power through upper atmosphere ionization, under the terms of a weapons contract. Tony, you couldn't just hide Green Grid from Taxac. It's too big. It needs too much juice. Wouldn't it just look like clouds? You want to hide a cloud? Find a hurricane. Or a typhoon. AIM and Ultimo are right here. They'll have the whole place defended with protean ordnance and arc armagers. Jarvis, pull up the camera on the flight deck. This'll even the odds a little bit. <laughs> well, let's get it prepped for launch.
nervous, I can't even see what you're trying to do. They're throwing up a flash. Take the batteries forward, fire. Light them up. They're jamming us. Repeat, incoming. Bogies are approaching. Yeah, trump card. Rody, do it. Armager inbound. All batteries, fire. It's called protein, sir. We need to move to capital class ordinance or we're done. Defense grid compromised, sir. And the armager is hurt, too. Weapons online in five seconds. Good to hear. Rody, run interference. No surprises. We're going through the front door. targets.
The Arc Armager is not as nimble as you are. It may need your assistance in this battle. Flanking turrets on each side of this area. SenseNet is picking up recon patrols inbound. Talk to me about the storm reasons. Can we fly to the command fortress yet? There's too much interference from the epicenter of the thunderstorm, sir. I suggest proceeding with a ground base. Heads up, guys. Armager's incoming from the west. I don't have time to intercept. You'll have visual in... now. I remember when these guys used to be scary, Jarvis. What do you think their chances are now? Never bring a knife to a gunfight, sir. <laughs> 